Origin provides a peak analyzer, which is a wizard-based tool that provides multiple goals like peak finding and peak fitting. This is an advanced tool with a variety of options. However, what if your requirements for peak analysis are simpler? With this in mind, we created a new app called Peak Deconvolution, which is available for Origin Pro starting in version 2019. Here, I have my sample data, which has noticeable peaks and some possibly overlapping peaks. I do not need to subtract the baseline for this data. However, there is an option to set the baseline from multiple methods. For this example, I will select none so that no baseline is subtracted. Now let's select the peaks tab. Similar to the peak analyzer, there are several methods for finding peaks. I can restrict the peaks to be positive only, and because there are overlapping peaks in this data, I can choose the option second derivative. When I select find, I notice that the app finds too many peaks in my data. This is because there is a lot of noise in my data. To fix this, I can smooth my second derivative and then find peaks again. The number of peaks is still quite large and therefore I will change the smoothing peaks to a higher number and try again. Now I am satisfied with the peak findings. The app found all the obvious peaks and peaks in the overlapping areas. I can then use the app to control peak type, parameters, and its bounds for, fi for fitting. There are several buttons to control the fit, such as showing second derivative, hiding or showing peak markers, changing the peak markers to only show X and Y data or only X data, and even rotating the peak markers. At the bottom, there are also options such as fixing all the peak centers. As well, one can apply bounds. Because I have already chosen positive peaks, the app has already applied a zero as a lower bound to all parameters. Let's say I want to restrict the width of this channel to be no larger than 100. I can input 100 as an upper bound for one of the peak and then apply the bound to all corresponding parameters by selecting this icon. I would like to make sure that the baseline is fixed to zero. Now I'm ready to perform the fit. I notice that the fit converges and the tolerance was met. There are several options for output. I can output a summary for the current data. I can as well perform batch peak fitting with these settings to multiple columns in the same worksheet. And lastly, I can create a report for the current data. I will select this option which will close the app and generate a nice report graph and a table of values and cumulative fit peak for the individual peak lines. Hope this app is useful and please provide feedback.